good early morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. Look, I got my fresh new mask on, fresh new hairdo, and a theme park that we have not been to in a long time. Forever. Disney's Animal Kingdom. Wow. There's the tree of life. There it is, in its glory. It smells so good. It does smell so good. And this is the second time we've been to Animal Kingdom since Feb February? Yeah. Wow. And we can't do much because, you know, Jamesy boy. <laughs> but we're just gonna relax, see some animals, stroll around. We just learned something we never knew before. That that Marley is an American crocodile and he was rescued. They said he said he was rescued from SeaWorld and they didn't have a place he for him. SeaWorld. Pink SeaWorld. And that they brought him here and he's one of Animal Kingdom's only rescue animals because they're not a rescue facility. Right. Um I love that guy. He's so big. I know. What are we going on? This is actually, I don't even know what it's called because it's the first time I'm ever going on it. Really? Triceratops thing. You I and I'm with the air horns. And I've never yeah. been on it. Yeah. But literally, Sarah can only go on like three rides. I love Primeval World. We would go on Primeval World if it was open, even you. <laughs> be down right now but it's still beautiful to look at oh creepy i don't want to jinx it because i know it's early and it's gonna get hot as the sun stays out further but it is beautiful it's there. really nice breeze it's like 81. That nitro coffee, really good by Joffers. <laughs> We've been here for like, what, 40 minutes? Yeah, we just sat, enjoyed. They're like having the characters come out like crazy on the water. But we're in this shade, so it was like nice and cozy. Yeah. We're gonna try to see if Rafi we heard Rafiki's Planet Watch is back open. Yeah. So we're, we're gonna, gonna go see about there. checking that out. Yeah. Welcome aboard the Wildlife Express with service to Rafiki's Planet Watch. Here, you'll discover a wide range of animal adventures. Oh, there's Rafiki. Oh. We haven't been here in a long time. I know, I'm so excited to be over here. Yeah. Yeah. And I like this goat that's stretching its neck up. Yeah. So you can't go in and pet them, it looks like. Yeah. But it looks like this cast member is given some details. God bless you. I think cast members can sign up. Like internal cast members can sign up to come hang out with the pets because they do miss the interactions. Yeah. They're also still doing the animation experience here, so that's nice. God bless you. That's sunny, making me sneeze. Um, I don't think we have really been in here when like this is all active. Look at they're getting all the food ready. Look at that. Ooh. This is fun. They have like a behind the scenes of the filming of the Disney Plus series. Look at that. It's fun that they brought this back. The animation classes. Looks like they're drawing Dumbo. Look at Walt. And Thomas. 100 years of beauty and wonder. I want to go to all the national parks. You want to go to all the national parks? Yeah. Wouldn't that be a life goal? Yeah. We've been to two, I think, right? Um. We've been to Springfield, which is technically a national park, Lincoln's home. 
Have you been to the dunes? I don't think I have been. Not been to the dunes. We've been to... So we went to the Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon. And where was Painted Desert? Um, air, oh, Petrified Forest. Petrified Forest. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, we did go, like, deviate. Yeah. We would have gone through Joshua Tree, but oh, when we man. went up to Las Vegas, we skipped it. I would have loved Joshua Tree. Yeah. We can always go back. All right, we did a little shopping. So yeah, when we get home, but now we have to go run errands. So we're already leaving. It's just about 1.30. Yeah. Well, we did more than we even expected we could. Yes. Had a nice time with your coffee. Yes. It's so crazy when we do things and we're like, the next time we're here, we'll have our baby. And that we're for sure true. not coming back here until after he's yeah. born. Oh my gosh. <laughs> After days and days and days of yearning, she finally found her soup. This is interesting. Fall harvest. Oh, there's nothing egg in it. That should look good. That looks good. One of our quickest, most successful trips ever, and we got snacks for the road. Oh, yay. We are home. Sarah's mustering the energy to edit the vlog because of going that. Animal Kingdom early, the vlog's not up yet, but she's about to, she's getting rolling rock. Ooh, she is. But in the meantime, I'm going to make these garlic knots that we picked up from Aldi. And I'm going to make some, or heat up some minestrone soup that Sarah wants for dinner, even though it's early. But I mean, it's dinner time. It's just about five. I just end up know that we're going to end up needing a snack on something later. Um, so I'm going to get that rocking and rolling before our evening of productivity and cleaning commences. One eternity later. All right, so, spoiler alert. I meant to say, spoiler, a spoiler alert. It was, it was a poorly executed quote from New Girl. Sarah fell asleep hours ago. I slept for like three hours? About. And I didn't wake her up and I didn't do anything. Instead, I actually fell asleep myself for like 30 minutes. Really? Yeah. But then, um... Eve got really snuggly. Eve got really snuggly. It always doesn't happen. Mm-hmm. Do you know something? She knows something's happening. She was the first one to know. Anyway, we're going to watch Hamilton because we just watched an awesome video um, that Joe Biden tweeted out, right? Mm-hmm. Maybe we'll put the link down below. Check it out. It's a Hamilton reprise of why you should vote so this is your daily reminder to figure out your voting plan if you haven't already voted tw over 20 million u.s americans have already voted including us two biden harris party supporters right here but figure out your voting plan your strategy and do it if you are a registered eligible american citizen of voting age um, but we're gonna watch hamilton now our night of cleaning ended up being a relaxed night, which I think I'm okay with because, like, we're going to get the cleaning done. We actually don't have a ton to do. It's more like dusting I want to do. She looks at us with every ounce of love in the, the entire universe. She's hanging on her every word. Yeah. Um, but I had another purpose yeah, to this more, clip. It's more like dusting that I want to get done. Yeah, which is like a tag teamed effort that takes not too long. Oh, you're super cute. Get ready for the Burkharts to travel. And I know we've been saying that for a long time. But uh, I hope you know that since the fa even the Fab Five 207 days, the entire purpose and every waking moment of our lives has really been centered around starting our family. And we are days away from having the beginning of our family. And more important, like, that's been more that important. Nice? A car outside. Yeah. That's been more important than daily vlogging, than Disney, <coughs> than moving out of Chicago, than moving to Chicago, than anything. And I think our other goal has always been travel. Yeah. And we've always been put that, that's always been second, third, fourth to the mission of starting our family. Yeah. And so we did just watch like a good hour of Currently Hannah, which always gets me uh, yeah. riled up in the travel mood. want to go to Tokyo so bad. Yes, but we've got plans, but pretty much as soon as James is here, as soon as and COVID... COVID well, Chills. I mean, like James first, because yeah. we could, if we had James right now, we could travel to other U.S. parts even with COVID. Yeah. But our international travel, we need James here, which is happening very soon, and we need COVID to get under control, which is hopefully happening in the next year. Then we travel. Evie needs a passport. We're gonna go above my head. Who's who's over my shoulder? Perfectly splendid. <laughs> 
That's what she looked like. Perfectly right now. splendid. She oh, is. she went. She went blurry when I said that. Are you haunted? We uh, did a lives randomly, and it ended up with us getting Taco Bell. So, this is where I'm at. All Sarah wanted was refried beans. I don't know what it was. Thank you. We also got. This is supposed to be, I think, the taco that you were supposed to get the Dorito taco that you were supposed to get the other night. Mm -hmm. Here's a fork. I think it's, this is a quesarito. Not for me. Oh, then I have a lot of food to eat. <laughs> oh, goodness. I got my own. My, I got my own. I told you just this. I thought it was like that plus one of these, and I was being splurgy and getting you both. Splurgy. Well, thank you. It's our toasty. That was fast. I know. Ooh, it is excessively late, but we've been asleep. Oh, today was sweetest day. Shoot. October 17th. Ooh, it's a long one by Stephen R. Covey. You have to decide what your highest priorities are and have the courage pleasantly, smilingly, not apologetically to say no to other things. And the way you do this is by having a bigger yes burning inside. So soon. So, so soon. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.